How's everybody doing today? This is Yukon back with another video. I'm out here in Daytona Beach at the Pendleton and I did just take a little dip in the pool uh, finishing up this video here. Today's video is on AMP. It's another weekly coin video so my Discord did vote for this one. And uh, AMP is pumping guys. It's pumping. We did not miss the train though. I do not think we did. I'm going to pick up some AMP and stake it myself uh, right after I get upstairs and dry off. Um, yeah, if you guys haven't already, like, subscribe, share, hit the bell, and thank you guys for your continued support. I'm trying to get the most and best content out to you guys. Um, you know, I love this community, and I want all of us to make a lot of money. So, yeah, guys, let's get into the video. All right, everybody, here we are at amptoken.org. Just got here from CoinGecko. I went to AMP. And their link is right here on website. I did vote, and 90% almost of people are feeling good about AMP, and you can see why. This is literally just a 24 hour chart right here. We're up 30%. I mean, goodness, guys, I don't think this is gonna stop anytime soon either. Um, I wish this would have been on my radar a little bit sooner. So we'll just read the opening statement here. Let's take money into the 21st century and provides assets like BAT with instant verifiable assurance for any real world application. And if we want to look at their partners, so this is just generalizing what they can provide collateral for and we'll explain that more in a second, but let's look at their partners here. So the main two are Flexa and Consensus, Consensus audited their smart contracts giving them verifiability uh, it's built on ethereum blockchain so it adds a, a base level of security that ethereum can provide uh, which is like very it's a very secure network um, amp itself is proof of stake but it has that proof of work base level right now currently until eth 2.0 comes out flexa just to give a quick definition if you don't know what flexa is flexa is a regulated Pure digital payments network using new technologies such as real-time collateralization and blockchain consensus and powered by relationships with premier banks and exchanges around the world. So Flexa is basically just a uh, payment system, a digital payment system that uses collateral to like instantly transact. So this is pretty big. Walmart actually uses Flexa and I thought that was very interesting. Um, we have some other partners, Coinbase, Gemini, Bittrex, Sushi, Uni, Loopring, Bancor, Balancer, CoinGecko, and they got Chainlink as well. So Chainlink is their Oracle system. I mean, if you don't have Chainlink, then you probably are not like a solid project yet. Chainlink is the green light, so it's good that they have it. So I think the most important part of understanding AMP is understanding the relationship between AMP and Flexa, and this is directly from their website, so I'll give it a read. AMP is an open source collateral token standard that enables instant and irreversible collateralization of any form of value transfer. Flexa is a payments network that enables fast and fraud proof payments for merchants all over the world. By using AMP partitions as collateral pools, Flexa can secure payment authorizations while the underlying asset remains unconfirmed and approve merchant transactions in close to real time. In helping to develop the AMP token, Flexa contributed two years of research and development to the token architecture and design, and developed and released the first AMP collateral manager contract as open source. So the collateral manager contract being open source is pretty awesome. It makes it super easy for any merchant to take that code um, and if they have a developer on their team they can use it to develop an app that will allow them to interact with Flexa um, or they can integrate that technology into an existing app and um, yeah it's there for anybody to use so basically how the transactions work is say I have AMP and I wanted to use it to pay for a Baconator at Wendy's but I actually want to use Litecoin. I just need the AMP to have instant transactions so I can pay for that Litecoin. So what I do, which you can use, just use your AMP, but if you wanted to pay for it in Litecoin, what you could do 
is you would allow Flexa to have access to wherever your Litecoin stored. And then you would basically Flexa would create a smart contract where you'd have to stake the amount of AMP that would be needed to pay for the cost of your Baconator. And Flexa would pay out to Wendy's giving them transaction insurance so they got their money the second part of the smart contract would be you giving your litecoin to flexa and if that happens they release your staked amp back to you and you can reuse it to do another transaction if you want to if you can't provide the litecoin though flex would just liquidate that staked amp and take that as payment so that's how the system works it's really efficient. It actually is much more efficient for merchants than using like traditional legacy payment systems where if people pay by card annually, they pay about three to 5% in fees trying to process those transactions done by card. That's not really good for businesses. Flexa makes it much more cost efficient because they can skip about seven of the, st uh, the 10 steps that it takes to actually process payments um, so this is good for businesses this is good for um, consumers as well and uh, yeah I think it's a great project the more businesses that get on board the more stable the price becomes and you know the, the more real-world adoption we get I think right now this is like one of the best like use cases for like payment I've seen and um, I think it's only going to be improved upon. I think there will be better technology um, eventually, but as of right now, this is a good start. And um, yeah, there's a fixed amount as well, so it's non-inflationary, which is good. Um, yeah, great coin, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and leave it at that. If you like the video, hit the thumbs up for me, uh, subscribe, hit the bell button, share it, and I'll catch you in the next one, guys. Peace.